guys, my name is Red Wolf, and welcome back to another Harry Potter Hogwarts mystery. So this is part three. Um, so our energy is full. We can finally go do this shit now. We can go to the Great Hall. If you guys don't remember, um, we left off in the last part. Um, we had to wait like an hour and 45 minutes before we could talk to Rowan again. So that's what we're going to do right now. She's in the Great Hall. Meet with Rowan. Damn. What is this, like, dinner time? Everybody's, like, fucking dining and shit. Huh? All right. So Rowan says, How are you, Luna? Have you had any more visions since we left the artifact room. Oh, I mean, like, have any other ghosts farted in my fucking eyeballs? Um, <laughs> let's see. No, I would tell somebody. Someone. But with Marua going on about my brother, people already think I'm mad. I mean, girl, you are kind of crazy. I know you're the one who deserves to be upset, but these visions have me rattled. Do you mind if we catch our breath for a bit? Sure, Rowan. Right. That's probably a good idea for us both. Alright. Your vision really has me worried, Luna. Six turns left. Okay. This is not time, great. Have you had visions before? I don't trust you enough to say. I don't think so. I've heard voices before. Let's not, like that, okay, we're not going to do the first one. I don't trust you enough to say, because that's fucking shitty. I mean, we did just meet the girl, but like, I'm going to go with I don't think so. Ellipses. Alright, let's go with I don't think so. Okay, that was not, that was not the best. Okay, we're trying to get the best answer possible. I'm also trying to stay true to myself, but come on. Visions can be dangerous. I'll be fine. Yeah, recover. That's why I need your help. You're making me feel worse. Like, no, that's a shit thing to say. That's why I need your help. Or I'll be fine. Hmm. What should I do? I'll be fine. Yeah, I'll be fine. Let's go with my fucking general. Oh. <laughs> Cavalier attitude. I'll be fine. Have you had visions before? I'm failing so far. Like, I'm not getting the best answer. Fuck me. Have you had visions before? I don't think so. I don't trust you enough to say no. Fuck that. I've heard voices before. I guess. We're trying to go for the best answer, right? Apparently, our character is uh, fucking crazy. Oh, there's a reason why your name is Luna. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Yes! Thanks for making me feel better, Luna. I'm just worried about you. Girl, you and me both. I'm feeling a lot better now, Luna. There are just a couple things that are still worrying me. I'll answer all your questions, Ra. You'll see there's no reason to worry. Two turns left. All right, we can do this, guys. Do you think it was a warning or a clue? Maybe both. Yeah, we're probably doomed. <laughs> We're probably fucked. That's that's our answer. We're, we're fucking fucked. I'm not sure. Let's go with, with we're fucking fucked. And no, I'm just kidding. Um, or a clue. Maybe both. Yeah. See, you girls got to write all the right answers. We got this shit on the lock. Thanks, Luna. We'll work out what your vision means together. All right. Our friendship level. Yep. Level three. Ooh, I got five diamonds. I feel better about my visions, but I'm still anxious about this duel. Thankfully, the dueling book we found details everything you need to know about about everything you need to know to defeat Marula. God, I can't fucking read. 
That's great, Robin. What did you find? So many things. What do you want this new book spell to do? Herper. <laughs> I mean, we are in fucking Slytherin after all. Embarrass her. Have many uses. Fuck, these are all good answers, too. The Slytherin in me wants to hurt this bitch. Embarrassment, though. I mean, that is... Either way, it's going to be like, if we hurt her, she's going to be embarrassed. That's how I look at it. I mean, I kind of want it to have many uses. That's my big brain kicking in. So I'm going to go with have many uses. I want to be Barula in a duel, but I'm not a dueler. Teach me a spell I can use for other things besides dueling. Oh, fuck. Well, I didn't... Fuck. I, I thought you meant, like, the book. Like, I want the book to be useful for multiple things, not just dueling. Oh, shit, I skipped that. Whoops. But there's the most amazing piece of information in the book. <laughs> Professor Flitwork is a champion dueler. You should ask him to give you some tips, or even teach you a cool dueling spell. I know a cool dueling spell. It's called the Vada Kedavra, bitch. <laughs> Thanks so much, Rowan. I'll learn all of this as fast as I can before Marula has a chance to bully anyone else. Yeah, it's called Vada Kedavra. You kill the bitch, she never bullies anybody again. I'm kidding. Fucking kidding. Don't have Vada Kedavra anybody. Killing is bad. You go to Azkaban. Alright, we did good, right? And our fucking energy is still there. Yeah, let's go talk to Professor Flitwick. Damn, it's fucking night out. What are you doing out here, Professor Flitwick? Uh, excuse me, Professor Flitwick. I have a question for you. Yes. Yes. Jesus Christ. What can I do for you, Miss Silver? Professor, is it true that you were a Dulian champion before you were taught Hogwarts? It's true. I can stupefy Protego with the best of them. I have a shelf full of trophies to boot. Do you think you could teach me some of what you know? <laughs> that fucking sly face, though. That sly face. The Hogwarts cur curriculum includes lessons on, on many defensive spells, Miss Silver. Oh. I didn't like that. <laughs> I need some ad advanced instruction, Professor. Hmm. Tell me, why do you want to duel? No reason. No, I just push for uh, academic purposes. No reason at all. Dueling is cool to defend myself to learn more skills. Should we be truthful and be like defend ourselves? I feel like he's not gonna. Nah, nah, nah. nah. To learn more skills. <laughs> I want to learn everything I can while I'm at Hogwarts. I would be doing myself a disservice if I didn't try to learn more from my champion dueler. Well said, girly. Hmm. I appreciate your ambition, Miss Silver. We are in fucking Slytherin. Ambition is one of our things. Teach me, Professor. I won't let you down. Hmm. Please, I wouldn't ask if it wasn't so important. Ugh. I was afraid things might be difficult for you here at Hogwarts, giving your brother's reputation. Oh, come on. You can't fault a girl for her brother's actions. I may be able to teach you something that served me well on my way becoming to on, on way to becoming a dueling champion. Yes, I will teach you one spell. The Dueler's Most Essential Spell. Expelliarmus! Expelliarmus! Yeah, baby! Alright. 
that's cool because Harry fucking used that throughout the fucking years in Hogwarts. That's his favorite fucking spell for fuck's sakes. Even so, um, like, uh, Remus Lupin made fun of him because, like, that's his go-to spell against Voldemort even. All right. Let's learn this spell. Start. We got one hour to learn this spell and five stars to pass. We can do this. Just grip. I'm gonna address the grip in my one already. <laughs> so many fucking Harry Potter sex jokes could be made. Oh, I'll be nice. Oh, wait. <laughs> We got this. Titan grip. <laughs> Concentrate. You're not concentrating hard enough. Listen to Flitwick. How many fucking things do we have left? Six. All right, we can do this. Take a break. Yeah, we need a fucking break because we need our energy to fill up again. Brilliant! Collect. Let's go. Aha! Good, you have the hang of it. Now let's see you cast the disarming charm on me. On you? Now! Well, shit, if you say so. Expelliarmus fucking flies. <laughs> <laughs> He's all like, oh shit, you've done it. You truly have a gift for charms. Wow, I am a charming lady. Hey, hey. Thank you so much, Professor Flitwick. This will be a huge help. You might also consider practicing with Mr. Cooper. He's hesitant. A very skilled. Is it the Gryffindor fellow? I will. I've always thought that Ben is better at charms than he lets on. Yeah, that's Ben. Hmm. Promise me that you will only duel if you have no other choice, Miss Silver. I promise. I promise I will only duel to defend myself, Professor. Hmm. Good. I believe you have great promise, and I would hate to see you... Ruin it by breaking school rules. You can't expect that much of me. I'm a Slytherin. Come on. Dueling is not allowed on school grounds without permission, Miss Silver. What about the dueling club? Technically, that's in school grounds. Well, that is in school grounds, not technically. No. <coughs> if you use the spell for anything except self-defense, I will be forced to recommend your expulsion. Jesus, fuck. All right, let's not get expelled. We don't have anybody on our sides, not even fucking Snape. I don't want to disappoint Professor Flitwick, but if I don't duel Marula, she'll never stop bullying everyone. Expelioma should be exactly what I need to win for our duel. Yep. Go talk to Ben. Hopefully this doesn't use any of our fucking energy because we need it. <laughs> Where's Ben? I forgot. Did it say where he was? Uh, he's in a great hall. All right, let's go talk to him. What's wrong, Ben? You look worried. I hope this doesn't use any more energy because we don't have any left. I mean, you look more worried than usual. I don't think I can do this anymore, Luna. God. What do you mean? I don't belong at Hogwarts. I thought I would be able to adjust, but the longer I'm here, the more I find to be afraid of. Listen, you need to grow a pair and stop being such a little fucking baby. How do you stay so brave? Dude, you're in fucking Gryffindor. I stay focused. Alright, our knowledge went up. When I feel afraid, I try to focus on learning new spells and potions that make me feel more confident and powerful. 
A very Slytherin fucking attitude. Good for you, girly. Trying new spells and potions is the thing I'm most afraid of. Oh my god, this fucking kid. Yo. You'll be fine, Ben. Let's just talk about what's worrying you, and I'll do my best to make you feel better. Okay, but I'll just tell you some of what's worrying me, so that we aren't here until the year end of exams. I don't think I belong at Hogwarts, Luna. There's so much to be afraid of. You'll get used to it. I'm never afraid of anything. Everyone feels afraid sometimes. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like that's the best answer. Everyone feels afraid sometimes, so let's go with that. Haha! -ha! That is the best answer. Our friends aren't scared. You're the bravest Ben. No, no, no. They're better at hiding it. We'll keep each other safe. Now they're better at hiding it. Oh shit. No, it isn't. Fuck it. Ugh. It's okay. We'll get better next time. Right? Plus, we got knowledge points. Thanks, Luna. I feel a bit better, but I'm still not sure I belong at Hogwarts. I mean, if you don't feel like you belong, then you probably don't. I'm just kidding. Everyone feels like that sometimes, but let's just talk more. Why was I put in Gryffindor? That's a great fucking question. You're more like a Hufflepuff, to be honest. You have to trust the Sorting Hat. You're braver than you know. Cowardice goes with Gryffindor. I mean, no, it doesn't. <laughs> but the Slytherin in me wants to say that's so bad. Um, you're braver than you know. Because we need to get our empathy up, right? I mean, not really, but yeah, like I said, I feel like that's the, the right answer. <gasps> that is such a gay. <laughs> you're so fabulous, Ben. You just don't know it yet. I feel a lot better. But I'm still wondering if I should go back home. Let's just keep talking, Ben. You'll see that we need you at Hogwarts. I belong in the Muggle world. You belong at Hogwarts, Ben. You can't ever go back. You can never go back. You can go back for the holidays. <laughs> All right. Um. Let's go with the, you belong at Hogwarts, Ben. All right. <laughs> Thanks, Luna. I don't know how to make it through Hogwarts without you. Did you make it through just fine? Oh, I thought I didn't get the last diamond. All right, cool. Level two, friendship. Five gems. Collect. <gasps> huh. You're so gay. Fabulous. Sorry, right. dude. I got you. I got you, all right? You were a little fucking broski. Thank you, Luna. I'm feeling much better about surviving my time in Hogwarts. Surviving. For fuck's sakes, dude. Helping others is a thing we're doing. Oh, is that, um, that actually sounds like the actor that played Dumbledore. Quest complete. Ooh, we got 50 empathy, one new gem, and 150 points of experience. All right, fuck yeah, I'll take that. And we leveled up. Awesome sauce. All right, so we got that done. Let's. Wigan wheel potion. Um, I don't think. Okay, well, we can do that because our energy's full again. That was fast, actually. All right, let's do go do the potion so we can get some coins. Is it true that we're learning how to brew a Wigan Whale potion today, Professor Snape? Uh. Why are you so grouchy, Snape? Relax. I told you, relax. 
it is when you inevitably fail to brew it correctly. Take responsibility this time instead of blaming Marula. Listen, listen. That bitch fucked up my potion. She did. Alright? I didn't just fucking blame her. I am a great potion. Master, assume to be your fucking senpai. Listen, listen, we're good, alright? I've heard that Wigan Mo potion can be useful in duels. Bitch, don't say that. He's gonna fucking. <laughs> That's not the right thing to say to Snape. Mmm. I sincerely hope you plan on breaking school rules by dueling. I sincerely hope you plan. He actually. It will give me the excuse I need to be finally. to finally be rid of you. Why Snape? Like, I, I don't know why the fuck I, that voice is coming up for Snape. <coughs> now take your seat and shut your mouth. Why do you shut your mouth? You're such a fucking asshole. Whatever, Snape. You hurt my feelings, Senpai. Today you will learn to brew the Wigan Wheel Potion, whatever the fuck that is. It's a powerful healing potion, okay, that can be used to heal injuries or reverse the effects of a sleeping draught. Well, shit, the more you know. Be especially careful with the sloth brain mucus. Ew, that sounds fucking disgusting and terrible. Oh, foolish wand waving in this class. <laughs> What does a penguin and a flamingo have in common? I don't know. What do they have in common? Alright. Ah. Okay, Snape. You don't have to make such fucking suggestive sounds. I didn't like that. Ah. Dude. We will begin with a demonstration of brewing the Wigan Wild Potion. Come up to my table. All right, we're full of we're full of energy, so we should be good. We should be able to finish this. I mean, it's got five stars, and it's probably a lot, but we should be able to finish this. Hopefully. All right, and we got another energy from that. Ooh. Should we get okay? We need coins. We don't have a pet yet, so like, let's not get the pet food. Keep track of all the ingredients. It's crucial. Focus. All right. Okay. Ooh, I got it at the last fucking second too. That face, though. <laughs> and the good senpai. Search for salamander blood. <laughs> Ew. The fuck? Where's my salamander blood? Luna, please help me find more. <laughs> Alright. Peruse. That's a funny word. Two stars and we got another energy. All right. Oh my god, a thousand coins. Fuck yeah. Give me those coins, baby. We need coins. Yeah. I can't see anything. I see something. Oh, fucking I can't read apparently like fuck. I see something, but I can't tell if it's salamander blood or iguana blood. Shine a light. Lumas. Brilliant. I told you, we're fucking good at this shit. <laughs> Prepare to add salamander blood. <laughs> Make sure we have everything for wig and oil potion. Then add your ingredients. Ingredients. <laughs> 
together. Yeah. Come on, one more. Ooh, we got another energy and more coins. Fuck yeah. All right, let's get the actual, yeah, let's get the food now. I need to start by adding salamander blood and ingredients. Are all those blood? That's fucking disgusting, dude. Bubble, bubble, bubble. I swear to God, if this bitch tempers with our potion, I'm gonna feel some type of way. I'm gonna smack her. I'm gonna like physically reach in the fucking game and just bitch slap her lights out. One at a time. Come up and weigh your lionfish spines. Silver, you're next. Oh, wait, I didn't do my fucking Snape voice. <clears throat> I'm sorry. One at a time. Come up and weigh your lionfish spines. Silver, you're next. I don't know why the fuck that's my Snape voice, but there you go. <laughs> Check needle. Okay. Collect some ingredients. Yeah, one more. Ooh, we got more energy too. Coins. Yeah, baby. Give me more coins. <clears throat> I need to weigh my lionfish spines. Weigh ingredients. The fuck is a lionfish? Is that like a real thing or is that just the Harry Potter world thing? Oh, we look pretty pleased with ourselves. Prepare to stir. <laughs> Continue stirring. No mistakes. I, oh, wait. <coughs> Continue stirring. No mistakes. I expect perfection. This is fucking getting more and more ridiculous. <laughs> Final star, yeah, baby. A thousand coins. Tell me why we're getting so many coins. Yo, I'm getting fucking excited with this shit. Hell yeah, we need a lot of coins, baby. Stir potion. Oh shit, don't. yo. All right. Brilliant as usual, your girl's got this. Am I right, gamers? Look at that fucking smile. She's all like, some pie noticed me. The fuck did he just say? I totally missed that. Oh. Wow, Luna, your portion looks perfect. Beads, of course it does. It appears to be possible. Fuck you too, Snape. Like you're such a goddamn asshole. I'm in your house. Be nice to me. I'm your student. I'm in your fucking house, like, for fuck's sakes. <clears throat> Miss Smiles' concoction, however, is flawless. I see how it is. Like, Snape always picks the fucking bullies. Like, Jesus Christ. Like, do I have to be a fucking... But the second I'm, I'm a bully, the second I fucking bully other people, he's gonna be like, no. <laughs> Fuck you. Ten points from Slytherin. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Professor Snape. Oh my god. Appease Snape. <laughs> mock Maru. I wanna mock her so bad. I wanna mock her. 
I feel like if we appease to Snape, that's just kind of like kissing ass, and he's not really good at. He's he's not really good at. But if I mock her, that's gonna look worse. I like how Crashing Snape is. Uh, it's locked because we're not level three in courage yet. Um, let's appease. Why not? Let's fucking kiss ass because I want Snape on our terms. All right, that's not so bad. I thought she was gonna say something worse than that, actually. <clears throat> what can I do to get better at potions, Professor? Can you suddenly become someone who is an entire... Wait, wait, wait. <clears throat> I keep forgetting to put my fucking Snape voice on. Can you suddenly become someone who is an entirely incompetent silver? That would be... An excellent start. Jesus fucking Christ, what's wrong with me? No, but I'm hoping I can become a little better by emul emulating your mastery, Professor Snape. I totally fucking thought that said something different. Harry Potter for life, yeah, hell yeah. I'll never match your skill and knowledge, but I'm hoping at least to become a middling student by copying a true potions master like you. We're appeasing the senpai! Yeah! Okay, so, um, Harry Potter 8, we're in Slytherin, and we're trying to fucking kiss ass to Professor Snape. And he's being such an a-hole to us, even though we're in his house. Nice blue hairs, right? I appreciate your determination in spite of being a hopeless failure. Senpai, those you break my heart. You break my fucking heart, Snape. Call me a failure. Like I'm in your house. You should encourage me. Ten points to Slytherin. Yay, we got ten points. <laughs> Professor Snape's recognized perfections when he sees a bitch if you don't shut the fuck up. I hate her. Ugh, to you too. And everyone recognizes that you're an embarrassment, Silver. I'll show you embarrassment. Like, it's in the back of my hand. Just reach over it. Oh. I'm sorry, Luna. Snape and Marula really do have it out for you. You've got no idea, especially this bitch. Snape is just a fucking asshole for everybody. I'm not worried about Snape and Marula. All that matters is finding my brother and the curse faults. The face, though. Alright. So we're done with that. We did good in potions, even though Snape doesn't want us to be good in potions. Marula is so annoying person, haha. <laughs> she is. Like, she sabotaged one of our potions, and now Snape has it out for us. And then when I was like, dude, she she, she sabotaged a potion, and he's like, don't fucking blame other people for your failures. I'm like, it's true. I'm awesome at potions. All right, we need, god damn, we need to wait two hours and 30 minutes for that. I feel like we can play some more gobstones or something. Let's go meet with Rowan. Oh, wait. That's the one that we need to wait. Never mind. Um, let's see. No, no, no. I want to go back. Wait, is Dobby here? No, Dobby's not here. I want more energy, man. We only got five. Let's go... Lower floor, yeah. Let's go to the lower floor. Is that where um the great hall is at? But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next live slash video.